Hey guys, what's up? This is Sparks, and I'm going to be showing you guys how to install the More Notches mod for Minecraft. So if you guys check out the link in the description, it's going to take you right to the well, right to this website right here, and it's going to say More Notches right in the very top here. Um, so if you guys scroll all the way down, um, you're going to see these download links right here. Um, either you can do that, or you can scroll all the way down here. This is really where I downloaded it. It says download the link right, right there. Um, but I guess you guys can just look through here. If you guys click on this download links, um, Dropbox, uh, Mediafire, um, but I clicked on this one down here. So this is the one I downloaded. It has a big download link there. Um, but it's very basic. Just find the download link on the website and download it and save it to your desktop just like this. It's so look more notches mod right there. Um, what you guys are also going to need is Minecraft Forge. So there will be a link in the description um, so you guys can download Minecraft Forge from there. It's going to take you to this Minecraft Forge website right here. And you're going to notice that right here, you're always going to want to download the very top version because that is the most updated version. And you're going to want to make sure you guys download the universal version. So make sure you guys download that and save it to your desktop just like that. Now another mod I'm going to show you guys how to install is actually Optifine. Optifine is not required for this More Notches mod, but it's always a great mod to install um, because of Minecraft lag. Now if you guys have issues with lag, so Optifine is going to be a great mod to install. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that, but again, it's not required for the More Notches mod. So once you guys have all those things downloaded right on your desktop just like this, what I'm going to recommend you guys do is go to Minecraft, and once Minecraft is open, go to Options, Force Update, click Done, and Log In. Now the reason why I'm doing this is because if, if you guys already have mods installed, I don't know if those mods are actually compatible with the More Notches mod, so I always recommend to either force update or back up your Minecraft. Now if you guys don't like force updating, you guys don't like black screens, that kind of thing, make sure you guys watch my video. There will be a link in the description. It's called Backing Up and Saving Your Minecraft. I show you guys how to do that. I teach you guys how to do it because, you know, I, people always said... Back up your Minecraft. Well, how do you do that? So I made that video, guys. Uh, check that out if you guys have issues with black screens, uh, force updating. You don't like force updating. You always you want to play mods together. So you always want to. You I show you guys how to how to basically install two mods at the same time. You know, in case you know they don't aren't compatible with each other. I show you how to fix that. So that's that's what that video is out. So anyway, check that video out or just force update like this. So make sure you guys have done that. Uh, once you guys have done that, make sure you guys close Minecraft. Make sure Minecraft is closed when installing mods or you will get a black screen. It will not work. So once you guys have downloaded all those things there and you guys have force updated or back up your Minecraft, you're going to see this percent app that are percent on the very bottom here. What you're going to actually do with that is you go to start and you type into start percent percent a P P D A T A. That's just one percent there. Uh, percent app data and another percent. Then you're going to see this roaming folder in the very top. You want to click on this roaming folder there, and you're going to see this dot Minecraft folder in the very top here. So if you click on that Minecraft folder, this is where you see bin resources and saves. Now if you guys open the bins folder, you guys are going to see this Minecraft folder right here. Now if you guys try to open it, it's not going to let you. So if you push OK. You right click on this Minecraft and open this with WinRAR. Now you guys can also use 7-Zip or other kind of things like that, but I use WinRAR so you guys show you how to do that. If you guys don't already have WinRAR installed, there will be a link in the description so you guys can download it and install it from there. And once you guys are to this point, uh, once you guys have the Minecraft jar open with WinRAR, you're going to want to see this meta in folder. Now if you guys uh, don't have that meta in folder because you already deleted it, make sure you guys delete this meta in folder. So right click here and delete these files and push yes. Always make sure you delete that meta inf because if you don't, you will get a black screen. So make sure you delete that. And now the next step you want to do is you want to open the Minecraft Forge Universal that you downloaded. Move this aside, and you're also going to see this meta inf folder right here. But you're going to want to leave that because that is actually part of Forge. So you're going to need that there. So if you just right click here, select all, and drag all these files right into the Minecraft.jar with an R. And you just wait for a little bit for this to get finished with, and you push OK. And you guys are done with the Minecraft Forge, so you guys can close that. Again, I'm going to show you guys how to install Optifine. So if you open Optifine um, and move this, oh, just move it aside like that, you're going to see all those things here. R again, right click, select all, and you're going to drag all these folders right into the Minecraft.jar that you open with Thinner, and push OK. And you guys are done with Optifine, so you guys can close that. And you guys are also done with the Minecraft.jar that you open with Thinner, so you guys can close that. Now this is where you're going to be back here where you open the Minecraft. You're going to go back one. This is where you see bin resources and saves. Now if you guys are lost, you don't know how to get here. Maybe I did this too fast. Um, anyway, how we got here was with percent app that a percent down and start. And then we went to the roaming folder and then we went to the Minecraft folder. And this is where we see bin resources and saves. Now what you're going to want to do here is you're going to add a new folder. So just right click, add a new folder. Uh, new and folder and you want to call this M-O-D-S all under caps mods folder and push enter and uh, you're going to want to open this mods folder make sure this folder is empty 
and you're going to want to just move the more notches folder right into this mods folder. So it's very simple. You just highlight that and move it right into the mods folder, and you guys are completely done with the installation. Hopefully this video helped you guys out. You know, I, I don't want you guys to go black screens. Make sure you guys follow this video exactly like I showed you. Um, if you guys are having black screen, uh, just force update. Make sure you guys follow this video, uh, you know, how I did it. Um, if you guys have issues with that kind of thing, make sure you guys back up and save your Minecraft. It's always a really smart thing to do. Again, that video will be in the descriptions. You guys can do that. Um, I hope you guys really like this video. Um, if you guys actually want to be part of the Blaze Army, make sure you guys have subscribed. I do a lot of mod installs and a lot of mod reviews on my channel. So you guys can check those out. Those are all pretty cool. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching.